The Seek But Not Finder's Guide to Procrastination, Part 5. Use the family as an excuse. Another brilliant scam and so convincing. You can play it forwards, you can play it backwards, you can even dance it right now and you can seem virtuous into the bargain. You can say your family has always done this, your family has never done this. It will break your mother's heart or your father would disinherit you. You can declare that you have responsibility to so many and they rely on you for their security. And it would be wicked just to serve your own needs. You can even say that their future is so important that you will have to spend every second of your life doing something that you really don't want to do. So much fuzzy thinking. Stop using the family as your excuse to avoid your responsibility, which is primarily to yourself. All other human beings have their own self-fulfilling mechanism and elaborate sacrifices just get in everyone's way. To really serve humanity and that elusive notion of the common good, passionately follow your own truth. Exquisitely dance your unique arabesque and make no excuses to anyone about it. An English herbalist in the middle of the last century wanted to discover the herbal law of the nomads of the Sahara Desert. As she was a single mother with two dependent children, she had every excuse in the world to procrastinate. But instead she bought an Afghan hound for each child and then set off with two hounds and two children in tow crisscrossing the Sahara Desert for two years, outraging the society she lived in and giving her children an education unequalled anywhere else in the world. There will always be a way. Don't use family as an excuse not to follow your dream. diamond-dance.ning.com diamond-dance.ning.com